Welcome back to Robocop Rogue City. Thank you back at the station, we're just recovering What's from having to fight a rogue, Ed 209. In the course of our investigations at the steel mill, we recovered the body of Officer Briggs, unfortunately, and his family will need to be notified. You all know the procedure by now. Officer Cecil will gather Briggs' belongings and deliver them to the family. They asked for a small funeral, so I expect everyone to give the family space. Briggs was one of us. We should at least do something to honor him. Best thing we can do is get those butchers that did this to him. I want to see everyone in the briefing room in ten minutes. Now back to work! Hey, Murphy. You've been to the hospital, haven't you? How's Lewis? Unconscious, but stable. <sighs> She'll pull through. I'm sure of it. It's time to hold OCP accountable. This can't keep happening. Relax, Kaplan. He's not wrong. How many more of us have to end up in the hospital or a morgue before we do something? It's like Sarge said, we need to get the guy who did it, so maybe let's focus on that? Speaking of which, there's someone who might know something. There's a guy in the jail that wants to talk to you, Robo. Our friend Pickles. I he bet. In the briefing room. He did tell us he would get in contact with us later. But he is in a holding cell at the moment. Welcome back, Robo. You have a minute? First of all, I wanted to say I'm sorry that I hesitated back at that steel mill. I already filed a report on the incident to Mr. Becker. Fucking right. <laughs> As I was writing it, I noticed a lot of opportunities to better myself. But considering that was our first mission together, it wasn't all bad, right? Yeah, it was alright. You were more of annoyance there than help. There are plenty of places to improve. That's actually something I wanted to ask you about. I've been getting to know different aspects of being a cop, and there's one thing that I keep underperforming at. Shooting. Would you mind showing me how you practice at the range? Yes, let's go. Yes, practice makes perfect. Let us not waste any more time. You want to go now? <laughs> yeah, great. Let's go. So we'll head over to the shooting range and show Officer Hercules. I love the smell of this. Should we start? So we showed off a little bit. I think 450, 470 points should be enough. Got a bunch of achievements for doing I took that. so many notes. Next time, do it quietly. Eliminate distractions. Being overeager is one of them. Ah, so that's the actual lesson. Now I get it. Is your service weapon properly prepared? I was issued this old gun and serviced it according to the manual. I will try it out. Sure thing. There you go. Alright, let's try out the officer's service weapon. Whoa. Huh. Shooting everything okay? high and to the right. Consistently. That will get him killed in a firefight. Your service weapon is broken. I calibrated it. I did everything the manual said. It is beyond repair. They must have issued it to you by mistake. Huh. I don't think that's entirely true. Other cops give me a hard time because Mr. Becker hired me to monitor you. But... I guess that's the way it has to be. We're going to get a new a gun. Must be ready. Get a different gun. Sure. Thank you, Robo. Now a pleasure. Ah, there's my favorite law enforcement op. It is Pickles. What kind of Why are pickle is he in now? Cell? I come here to think sometimes, and the food is better than in the soup kitchen. <laughs> You're that a freelance. Is resourceful. Why, thank you. I try very hard to not try at all. But seriously, I was hoping to see you. I heard what happened to Briggs. 
After everything he did for me, I'll do whatever I can to help you catch that Wendell guy. He seems pretty good at pitting people against each other. Maybe I'll find some of his dissatisfied customers who'd be willing to talk to me. It could be dangerous. You kidding? On the streets, I'm a samurai. Well, with Briggs dead, it probably makes me more of a... You are not a ronin. Yeah, okay. Just remember, if you need anything, I'm your guy. What is it, officer? Huh? Uh, oh, I, 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 I didn't realize I was talking out loud. It's just that I need to hang Briggs' picture on the memorial wall. It's just... a lot. Hey, would you be so kind and help me? All you have to do is find Briggs' photo in the database and print it out. Just make sure to hang it straight. Otherwise, I won't hear the end of it from Sarge. Easy enough, let's print it out. Let's go to find it in the database. Go to police officers. Let's have a look down. Oh, Murphy's still there. Printing that off. Very efficiently done. Thanks, Murphy. I still need to go get his stuff, so you know I'm gonna take care of the desk. But could you get his belongings from his locker? Pretty sad stuff. We were too slow to save his life. He Everything in the box. I'll make sure his family gets it. You know I usually do all of this alone, and it doesn't get any easier no matter how many times I do it. Thanks to Robocop's insubordination, we finally have something concrete. <laughs> At your service. <laughs> Wendell Antonowski struck a deal with the street vultures at Highland Park. A place where, for some reason, we weren't supposed to go. Be that as it may, we're on the lookout for anyone from this biker gang. We also know what he's looking for. Yeah, dead bodies. Dead bodies whose brains are still intact, to be precise. Wow. That's even more messed up. Why would he need him? We'll get to the whys, but for now we need to focus on catching Spike. He's our connection to Wendell Antonowski. Since they know we're onto them, I'm expecting them to be in hiding. They're not hiding. Put on Channel 9. I repeat, OCP Bank is being robbed by the notorious street vultures. We'll keep trying to get closer for a better view. Ooh, bank heist in progress. Cool, let's go and stop that. Sergeant, am I back on the case? I don't think Becker will give me grief if I let you go save OCP's money. You're reinstated. Everyone, move out! Lead foot it to the bank. Oh, three Ed 209s. Get those things away. Oh, look at that. One of the cops was actually bothered to show up. No need. SWAT's got it covered. What is the situation? Vultures came up with the great idea of robbing the OCP bank. They've got hostages, and they claim there's a bomb. They must be crazy to think that OCP will just let them leave with their money. Was there any sighting of Spike? Not yet. But I'm sure they wouldn't pull such a stunt without their leader. What is the plan? Let me make this clear. It's SWAT's plan. You're no part of it. Then you are going to need a new plan. Nice. The report is going into an active bank robbery with highly violent criminals. Good work. With this buggy brain of yours, you think you still remember how to put the heat on them scumbags? I prefer to serve justice cold. Yeah. Nice. Before we start, actually, let's change our motherboard. 
Got a new motherboard. Whereabouts is it? There we go, 3.2, and it looks like... So we got armor piercing and full auto from this one. The heads are a little bit extra squishy now. Whoa, that is a lot of guys. And I just realized that we're actually versing the SWAT team in a contest of skill. We've taken down nearly 20 guys to their eight. Five, sorry, they've only got five. Good job, SWAT. These guys got no chance. Yeah, <laughs> 28 to 6. We'll secure the area. All right, now we just need to find a way to open those shutters and see if there's any other secrets around. Got some evidence here on the table. Ooh, Alex Murphy's property. What's that doing on the desk? All right, let's move on. Oh, we have heaps of skill points to use, so we might use those. Five skill points. Right, we've already maxed out deduction, which was our main goal. So we're going to take scanning. Will I put up psychology? No, I think we'll go combat stuff because there was a lot of guys in the bank. So scanning. And then I've still got three points left. So possibly engineering. And one point in vitality maybe. Armor should could be useful. And combat for a shockwave and enhanced shockwave. I think we will go with... Engineering. Engineering. Armor looks cool. Deflects small arms at max rank. That lets us dash. So yeah, we'll take engineering. That's our biggest problem is our mobility in the big fights. And then we'll take some extra health as well. That's five points down. Right, so the floor is pretty much clear. No secrets to be found. Time to open the shutter. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> they better not go rogue. I only just fought one of them. Oh, we're still in contact. Contest with OCP. This time they've got Ed 209s. Shit, they're mowing them down. We better better get to it. They're going to do a much better job than SWAT did. Oh, Ed 209s are just mowing them down before I can get to them. Getting a bit frantic trying to trying to beat them. Oh, that's our new skill from Focus. Now we can deflect bullets off and kill people in cover. Wicked. Thankfully, the Eds won't be able to follow us. So we'll continue up here. Gate in lockdown mode in front of you. Find a way to get past it. 
Try finding the weakest spot in the wall around the gate and breach through that. Well, there's the breach. Ed's are counting down for some reason. They're gonna fight me. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Whoa, we just jumped into the middle of a gunfight between SWAT and the street vultures. I think we got them. Brain matter everywhere. They sound like orcs dying <laughs> from Warcraft. And the slow-mo camera's active. That skill's really useful. Didn't even see those guys and they killed them. So this new attachment for our Auto 9 has got a lot more punch. But it's got a lot more recoil and spread. Dead. One more. There he is. Nice. 64. Work hard and be happy. Don't act like you're all that impressive. With all that fancy tech. All right. The hardest part's over now, I think. Need to find the manager's office. Robocop, I've received information that the bank manager is held hostage in the vault. Where exactly is it? Find the manager's office, and we'll go from there. It's at the far end of the office area. Nope, nope, nope. Next one. Got some clues over here. Letter to be framed. In the envelope is a letter I mentioned. Please frame it for me so I can keep it on my desk. I still can't believe that our noble founder wrote a letter to me for 25 years of service. Your presence here is unauthorized. So is depriving thousands of people of a roof over their heads. But OCP doesn't seem to mind that. Explain. Delta City. A heaven on earth that OCP plans to build in place of old Detroit? A city of the future where there is no crime or poverty. Do you believe the commercials? I thought she was just sneaking in to film the bank robbery. But she's actually looking for corruption. Unrealistic plans are not a crime. But the ways by which they're pursued may be. In order to create Delta City, OCP must first get rid of people who live in old Detroit. Now that's a topic I'd rather do a story on than you glitching. OCP offered these people investment in the project. The value of their property would cover the cost of entering the business. The later gains will far outweigh the cost, supposedly. You do not believe that. It's OCP. There must be a catch, and I think I found it. The documents say something about additional costs. I believe that's a loophole that OCP placed in order to scam people out of their homes. That is only suspicion. And I need time to prove that my suspicion is true. Time and some of these documents I found. If you detain me, the SWAT jerks will requisition them. Hmm. Do we arrest her or do we let her go? Is she breaking the law? Let her go. You can go, but if you continue to disobey the law, you will be detained. Maybe I should have treated you more like a police officer than OCP's property. Anyway, the city owes you. And I owe you too. Right now she's just gonna casually stroll out. See ya. What is this? Is Alright, we're down in the device? bank vault. Shut Finally. Fucking mouth. Hello, boys. Five and five. Robocop! I knew our founder would send his best. <clears throat> We're not done yet. Mr. Becker, you're here. Oh, still what's this alive. prick doing here? I only played dead so I didn't end up like you, with a bomb strapped to my body. 
Robocop, you have to defuse it. The explosion could cause the company enormous losses. <laughs> Does he care about himself? Engineer. I saw that Orpheus kid playing puzzle games on his brakes. Ask him for help. I'll be watching you. From a Orpheus. Safe Every time he talks about him, he names him a different god. I am looking at a ticking bomb. A, a bomb? Okay, uh, I'm passing you through to the bomb squad. There is no time. I think I call I him Hercules. To defuse it. Gosh, I mean, I, I'll do my best, but, but just give me a moment. First aid, kidnapping. Are you looking for a bomb diffusing chapter in the police manual? Found it. First rule, call qualified personnel. Oh no. Okay. Tell me what you see. What we got here is some connectors with different voltage. Four connectors with different voltage. <laughs> What's the highest voltage? 24 volts. C4. It is a C4 explosive and seems to be homemade. Yeah, that's what I'd expect from the street vultures. Alright, we've got three different colored cables, but four cables four in total. Cables, green, two reds, and blue. Four cables? Got it. And a computer motherboard. Cables lead to the fuse. Does the fuse appear to be electronic? Affirmative. Okay, so they used this kind of bomb before. According to the diagram, you should detach three cables. Start from the one with the highest voltage, then proceed down one at a time to the one with the lowest voltage. There are two different color 12 volt cables. Which one do I detach first? Uh, okay, maybe this isn't the time, but I'm colorblind. I will have to improvise. Just remember, detach the one with the highest voltage first, then proceed down to the lowest voltage. Simple enough in theory. So we want to take the 24 volt one, which is the green wire. And well, then we need to take one of the 12 volt ones, but he said he's color blind. So I'm going to dare say he's blue color blind. Yep, didn't die. And then I guess it's one of the reds. But it'll be the highest red, so as long as we take the bottom one, that should be fine. Phew! Well, that was a crash course in bomb defusal. It was just a minor incident. Ready to get back to business? Because I need to make a withdrawal. Like, now. This guy is such a cock. I should really check upstairs. Nonsense. This is OCP. Money comes first. Now, open the See door. See on the there, theft. There you go, sir. Great. Now out of my way. I did notice a hole in the wall to the right. Is that how they got in? There's no money. What? the hell is this? Where is all the money? Our founder has most of our capital tied up in a very ambitious and resource-heavy project. Uh, I can't believe old man's blowing all of OCP's money on Delta City. Have some respect, young man. Oh, he spent all the money. They never got into the vault. Back with the money in the next... Well, I did get the money. Would they See what I'm talking about? Did they only get small change, perhaps? All right, let's get on the trail. No lights allowed. So I shot out all the lights and there was nobody in that entire section. Here we go. Finally, some enemies. Here comes the trouble.
little bit cornered here. Need to try and get out of the tunnel. Here they come. Good stuff. Oh, there was a radio man. We killed him straight away. <laughs> I can hear the radio. Sorry, guys. He's dead. You're out of the bank already? I am in pursuit of the workers. I have followed them into a tunnel. So that's how they must have gotten here in the first place. It seems they're retreating into the old industrial area. <laughs> Take the dumpster. Let's go. More bikers. It's the only building with street access in the area, and it's big enough to store their vehicle. They won't need to make people move out of old Detroit to build Delta City, because I'm just it's mowing them all the down. Roger that. I think 90% of the people in this city are corrupt. There's only 10% or so that are actually decent people. If you really just saw all your mates get decimated, would you do another pass? The recoil on that thing's insane since I upgraded it. I'll have to look at that. I think that's a laugh to them. Ooh, hit the post. Ooh, what's this guy? He's got chevrons above his head. See the boss. Kill the grenadier. Oh, that's a bit of a bit of a death funnel here. Can't quite get through the door. That guy just ate headshots like it was going out of fashion. There's quite a few contacts in that room. Got no health left. I think that's all of them. That was a lot of guys in here. Wait, there's one more. Where is he? Up there. Oh, God damn it. Room secure. Anyone listening to this? Oh, God damn it. Anyone listening to this? Yeah, me. I am listening, creep. Robocop. Why did Wendell Antonowski send you here? This was a suicide mission. We no longer deal with that arrogant prick. We had an agreement. We held our end of it. And apparently it slipped his mind to pay us for our services. Well, that didn't sit well with us. So now we're out to get what we're owed. The only thing you are owed is a prison cell. Yeah, I don't think so. I'm a vulture. I need my space. I'll see you around, cop. Well, the bank robbery was resolved. Back to the precinct. Before the attack, 
We all thought our money would be safe at the OCP bank. Yeah, glad we got Murphy on our team. I have pertinent information regarding the case. We'll get to that, Murphy. But right now, it's time for your psych evaluation. Becker will chew my ear off if I don't make sure you take part in it. So go. Dr. Blanche is already waiting in the observation room. Once it's over, join us in the briefing room. Hey, what's the big idea? Oh, the lights Piece are out. junk taser blew the fuse when I tried to charge it. So we just need to follow the cable. Apparently. There it is. Pretty straightforward. Goes up, over the door, down the stairwell, into the basement, over to the fuse box. Um... Nope. Yes. Uh, that one. Yes. Nope. <laughs> Start again. So we go. Eighteen. Nope. Eighteen. Four. Not. Nope. Eighteen. Four. One. Nine. Lucky we didn't burn the building down in the process. Detroit, shining beacon of hope. Thanks for the help, Murphy. All right, let's see what's cooking under the hood. Once I'm done, he's all yours, Doctor. All right, performance evaluation for the bank heist. All main objectives, no secondaries. Investigations, we found the secrets. We challenged the SWAT team. Oh, the bank intruder. Yeah, we let her go. And pieces of crime done. A rating. Very nice. Almost three levels again. Hello, Murphy. Now it's time for our appointment with the good doctor. I've seen your accomplishment on TV. I hope that I'll manage to remain professional despite sitting opposite a celebrity. How do you feel about being acclaimed as a hero again? Scumbags watch TV too. It helps if the criminals know that they should fear me. I suppose it makes your job easier. I'm sure you'd love to share this accomplishment with Anne Lewis. You've seen her at the hospital, haven't you? How is she? She is stable. You cherish that relationship, don't you? She's an important part of your life. Your past life, too. She is. Just like your family. You're very protective of your past. OCP cut me off from my family. And how do you view their decision to separate you from them? Uh, it was they for the not best, want I guess. To see me like this. Perhaps not. But the alternative isn't much better. Nevertheless, you still think about them, don't you? What comes to mind when you try to remember your family? I see. <laughs> Memories can be painful. I didn't get an option. Especially when they're connected to the ones you love. They tend to remind us of what we're missing. The thief that broke into my house I mentioned before. He was my brother. He was an addict who'd come over to steal things to sell so he could buy drugs. As you can imagine, my last memory of us together is not a happy one. But despite that, I still wouldn't want to lose it. It serves as a reminder of how I failed him. And I've been trying to rectify it ever since. I do not remember my family. I can only feel them. These feelings, how do they manifest themselves? Mm, as echoes? Echoes, definitely, yeah. I cannot but we're not going to tell you. <laughs> OCP sees them as obstacles that need to be removed. And now you're afraid that they sent me here to convince you they are right? Did they? What you need to understand is that regardless of outside influences, my client's well-being takes highest priority. Especially now that I understand how important these memories are to you, I will fight for you in every way I know how. If you let me. I think this is a good place to end this session. Thank you for your honesty. It certainly has been noted. If you're enjoying the series, guys, leave a like, and we'll see what goes down next in Old Detroit. Commander Tyrael, 
out.